Man, do I got a bunch of clips for y'all today. I, I've always seen these on or on the internet, and I'm sure a lot of people have. There's some that resemble some like this. Not exactly these videos, but maybe something similar to it. And I, I've always wanted some shit like this to happen to me in public or seen it in public. Not like I would do anything. I'm a pussy in public. Don't get me wrong. I ain't no fighter. But, you know, just to look at, just to see. It's actually one of the hardest shit to watch on your phone for me personally. It is the most, like, embarrassing shit. Like, I can't see how people would actually go through with things like this. So before I get into it, because I can go on about this shit all day, it is the biggest cry of attention I've ever fucking seen. But I'm going to let y'all watch this and let y'all... You know what I mean? Salivate in it. Salivate. What the fuck? Ba bathe in it. I don't know. Just get a feel for it and get where I'm coming from. So when I talk shit, y'all can side with me. I'm just so fucking confused why you gotta pour cereal and milk on your head to get this fucking message across. You know what I mean? And at that, he couldn't even wear the same fucking shoes. He got one boot and a sketcher, I think, a New Balance maybe. He repeats himself like eight, nine, ten times. He says the same shit, but just in different ways. And I think it's just because he knows everybody's looking at him. And he's probably fucking wondering if anybody's finna sack his ass for just dumping milk and fucking cereal all over the ground. I can already hear him at the end of the video already telling him like it's 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 for a motivational speech. I just I just wanna, you know, spread positivity. I just wanna spread the love and you know what I mean? I get all these views and this, this and then just shut your bitch ass the fuck up. God damn bro, this shit's so goddamn pathetic, dude. I don't know what it is that ticks me so goddamn hard, but God damn, what a loser, dude. I don't even fucking care if he paid for the cereal or the milk and then cleaned up the mess after and apologized and shook everybody's hand, kissed their shoes, and you know what I mean? Like, I, I don't, it's just, it just makes me so goddamn mad, man. I don't know why. But in this next video, we, it goes along the same lines. I mean, it's in Walmart, but not as bad because it's less of a fucking mess and you know what I mean? Less loud, but it's just super weird super annoying super stupid <laughs> i smoke and i don't eat look hey, just take a look oh shit 30 blinkers yo what's up guys this is how you take 30 blinkers in public in public Cheers, workers on damn 30 blinkers <laughs> a whole lot of blinkers man <laughs> look at the worker oh shit that one wasn't as bad so i'm not gonna beat them up too bad but it's just still so weird as fuck like hitting all these blinkers in public like what, what, what the fuck makes the difference if you do it at home and in public like no one seems to give a shit everybody we still everybody else was still checking out nobody was looking their way even homeboy was just, look look at the worker looking at you like, it still don't matter, but I get at the end of the day, it's for the people watching the video more than it is for the people around them watching them do the shit. But still, the links that people will go, again, like I said, this wasn't as bad, so it, like, it didn't really, no harm, no foul. They just smoked in front of people and still got a bunch of views for it, so it went in their pocket, I guess. But for somebody to pour fucking cereal on the head, and there's worse shit, like, I know y'all have seen worse shit, where people would would do all these crazy things, like, the links still go, but here's the video so y'all can salivate my stupid ass because y'all hey, can watch it and get get good with it I'm guessing there just either wasn't enough room at the beach or there wasn't enough people at the beach watching him work out. So he decided to go do it in a fucking public street because I he, he didn't. That, that's the thing with these guys. I mean, I love how they look and I wish I could look like a fraction of what they do. But they got so much fucking muscle. They don't even know what the hell to do with it. So they, they got to do something in front of the public so people appreciate all the fucking time they spend into it. You know what I mean? So for them themselves, they don't feel like it was a waste of fucking time.
But this one really got me just because it screams loser, man. Like, he has to fucking work out in front of people for validation. Like, you know he's out there for compliments and, like, other shit. Like, I'm doing this for a video. And, again, I know it's for the people I'm watching more. But look what the fuck he ends up doing. He ended up kicking a little toddler, a baby. Infant, I don't even know what the hell to call it. Kicked it right in the head. Like, it did. It looked like it connected for me, I think. I'm pretty sure it connected. Because even the baby starts crying. I don't think it'd cry if it fucking got two feet in front of its face. It just probably weave back a little. But, man, you know what I mean? There isn't no better place to fucking do it. He has to come and do it on scaffolding. But that's going to do it for this video, man. I appreciate everybody for watching. it. I hope you have a blessed day. And thank y'all. And I'll catch y'all later, man.